Every time you check your bank accounts, it seems there is some new type of heat fee you're getting hit by. You may be able to do something about it. Call for Action's Keith King is here to explain. Yeah, good evening, guys. Thanks to the financial crisis and recent legislation, banks are now scrambling to make up some money. And that means extra fees for you, but you do have some options. Tired of being nickeled and dimed by, of all things, your bank? You're not alone. This month, Money Magazine writes about bank fees, how to negotiate them down, and how to make a break from your bank. First, bank fees. They're rising and spreading. In a recent survey, Money Magazine found fees for using another bank's ATM has gone from a buck 25 in 2007 to at least $2 this year. New fees are popping up. It's not uncommon to get hit with a three to five dollar charge if you still receive a paper bank statement. Free checking is becoming harder to find. 39% of big banks offer free checking this year. That's down from 64% just last year. You may be able to avoid fees if you go with multiple accounts such as checking and a savings account. If you choose to leave first, speak to a branch manager. They may try to fit you into a less costly scenario. If you do make a break from your bank, remember this. Money Magazine suggests get organized. Many banks offer switch kits to help you catalog your transactions to move. And one more piece of advice, once you move and close out your old account, it doesn't hurt to put everything in writing and then send it to your old bank. Simply state that you are moving on. No need to explain why. You'll find more tips on our website.